Here we are in Aichutaki, Cook Islands. Woo! We're here finally after years of dreaming of this place. Keep left. You want to get a beer? Probably be a lot cheaper with our coupon book. are so cute and little. Hi! You don't bite, do you? You bite? I bet you bite. Ew, you're gross. Oh, there's yeah, over there. Yeah, yeah, oh. And look, there's a baby chicken down there. Oh wow, he's friendly, hey? Yep. Look at him. That girl had Bob. She killed four. Yeah, she lied she on it. She lies on it. Oh. oh. But that was she lied on it when she first called birth. No, not this one. What's, What's his name? name? Nico. 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 Can he fly? Or did you cut his wings? Oh! oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and the cat doesn't eat the chicken? Nope. Huh. He's too big. Did we make it? Yeah, it's blinking, but we need it. How much did they go cost us? Uh, 20 bucks. Five bucks. We're already over five bucks. Arutaki no kamimo! Hamimo! out of the country we're heading to beverage reef a catamaran actually just wrecked there yesterday it will be pretty fresh to the scene seems like there's quite a few of these catamarans wrecking around here on the outside of reefs i guess uh the cruising here you have to zoom in on the charts sailing is dangerous I had no idea it's cold out there and how does that smell it smells awful it smells like bilge <laughs> i don't think they've come out of the bag since florida it's certainly been a while it's like two it? years i'm cutting all my sockies it's like one of those islands that people used to run into and still do occasionally because it's like two nautical miles off on the charts and it's just a ring of reef in the middle of nowhere. We got a uh, 25 gusting to 30. 
That's okay though, we're going downwind. Let's see what happens. to some contour lines, which Ben always thinks is a good sign, and sometimes when you troll around these atolls, the fish hang out here. What lure is this on? Can we afford to lose it? Well, it's on a monofilament leader, so... Holy shit. Of course, the wind has to come up right now. Oh, wow! You can see it back there. Forward again? ever caught it's certainly the meanest toughest baddest an hour and a half long fight that Ben's ever fought on this boat. Do we want that big of a fish? Hopefully it shows itself soon would be good. We'll call it mumbo jumbo. Oh, oh my god it's a shark or something. Do you think it is? I think it's a shark. What are we gonna do with the shark? But you don't want a shark flopping around in the cockpit? Maybe it's a tuna, shaped like a shark. Holy F, it's huge! No, don't take the line, don't take the line. No, 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 no. I'm literally having to pinch the line with my fingers to put more drag on them with the real. You know how these things always end, you lose them at the boat. How fun, easily! Uh, it's probably been two hours now. It's getting close, yeah. I can feel the line, the line's starting to burn. Almost ready for a gap? It's a marlin. It's a marlin? How do you know? It's a tuna! I think it's a tuna! Tuna shark marlin, what the hell are you? You're giant! I've never seen this thing! It's a tuna! Oh my god, it's... Woo! Get on board, baby! Big, big, big tuna! Woo! I thought it was a shark! I didn't know they got that big. Well, let's strategize this. I take the rod and you gap it. I think you should just drag it up inside the boat, up the steps and in. Yeah. I would never, ever normally let that happen, but this thing's worth it. Neutral. Come on, dude, just give her up, man. Oh, I can't do this anymore. <laughs> I seriously can't do it. You've got to do it. You've got to do it. Keep me a hand on this. I don't want to lose him. Good freak. The power of this thing is just insane, Ash. Good lord, you're going to smell like a fish for a month. His mouth's not moving anymore. Now it's suffering. Good lord, look at her 
Whoa, I've never seen anything like this. <laughs> oh yeah. I need a beer after that. I think you've earned it today. <laughs> Holy crap. This is like the biggest adventure of my life. <laughs> you wanna talk adventure? That's adventure. <laughs> We're gonna measure him. So from the corner of his mouth to the tip of his tail. Five centimeters. I went end off. I don't want to lose him. Gotta even hold the camera. <laughs> Five o'clock now. Now we have to do about four hours of playing, I think. Now the hard work begins. 150 pounds! I think it's more than 150 pounds. It's 200 pounds on the hours. <laughs> We've been doing this for seven hours. When you catch that big of a fish, it's like a full-time job. I'm feeling up me. Tomorrow we're gonna be in an anchorage, Beverage Reef, which is the middle of nowhere. And we'll have enough tuna for every single boat in there. And I think enough tuna to last us the rest of our trip to New Zealand. And it's yellowfin, my favorite. Hope you enjoyed the show. There's whales right there, right there. There's one, a little blow, but they're like gone. Of course, once we got the camera ready. Oh, it's starting to speak. This is the second wreck we've seen in uh, probably just over a month. Uh, this one hit Beverage Reef here. On a lot of charts, chart plotters, Beverage Reef isn't really shown properly at all. And they accidentally ran into it be when they were sailing between uh, I guess somewhere in the Cook Islands and, and New England. It's pretty tragic, gorgeous boat. Oh, it's so sad, eh? So I can't tell if there's any, uh, any rudders or anything. Probably all got torn off when they drug it off the reef. This is an older wreck on uh, Beverage Reef. It's an old fishing boat. <laughs> and I think it's been here about, probably what, five years at least? 10 years? Because we saw old cruising vlogs of uh, fellow cruisers that had it and it was half afloat still. So this place does take its toll. Let's not head a reef. No, no, no. Uh, I went for the liquor uh, spirit here. Yeah, we have some rum and some vodka. 